Hey everyone, welcome back to Awesomer Pro. Today we're going to use Play-Doh to make some flip-flops in a bag. We're still a ways away from summer, but we can imagine it's warmer by making summer items. So that's what we'll do today. Alright, let's start by rolling out some black Play-Doh. By the way, you don't need to use the colors I'm using today, but if you do want to get that summer vibe, I would suggest using bright colors. Once you roll it out like this, make a sole template using a piece of paper. Best way is to just print out a sole design if you can find one online, or you can draw it. Okay, now let's use this sharp tool to make a Play-Doh sole. By the way, starting off with black Play-Doh to make the sole for the flip-flops, and then we'll add some color to it. Perfect! Now let's use this skewer stick to add some details. Awesome! Here's a closer look. This is our bottom sole. Okay, now let's roll out some yellow Play-Doh. Going to use this cookie cutter to make a few shapes. Now let's roll out some pink Play-Doh. Going to make the same shapes using this cookie cutter. Now let's make the same shapes using blue Play-Doh. And we'll make purple ones as well. As you can see, I have a bunch of vibrant Play-Doh colors. Now let's start by grabbing one of the yellow shapes. Let's put the pink one right underneath. Let's place the blue one right below. And then purple. Now we'll just repeat that color pattern one more time. Actually, I think we can stop right here. Let's use our Play-Doh sole as a template and remove any extra Play-Doh. Perfect! Clean this up a bit. Now let's remove our colorful padding and place it on the other side. Awesome! Now we have to make one more, but I'll skip ahead. Perfect! Since we're going for the summer vibe, let's roll out some white Play-Doh and make a flower design. Let's use this stamp to make a bunch of circular shapes. And let's also roll out some yellow Play-Doh as well. This time we'll make some heart shapes. Alright, now we're going to cut the hearts in half. Afterwards, place each yellow piece on the center of the white Play-Doh. Once you have five ready, grab one and sort of shape it into a taco. Like this. Now give me a second while I do the rest. Once you have those shapes ready, overlap each piece just a little bit until you create a flower shape. That's beautiful. Pinch the back a bit and spread out the petals. Awesome! Here's a closer look at our flower. Now let me quickly make one more. Alright, now let's make the straps for our flip-flops. Going to use black Play-Doh again. Roll out two thin strands. Then grab the two strands and twist them like this. Twist it tight. Perfect. Now let's cut this in half. Alright, now it's time to attach the straps. Poke a hole here. And then poke two holes here. Okay, now let's grab one of the straps. We're going to cut off the end piece right here. Put one end inside the top hole, and the other end inside the right hole. Make sure it's attached. For the next strap, we'll put it inside the top hole again. But for the other end, put it inside the left hole. Make sure it's completely attached to the padding. Then let's add the final touch, our beautiful flower. Place it right here. Poke a little hole. Clean this up. Awesome! Here's a closer look at one of our flip-flops. Went ahead and made the other. And our Play-Doh flip-flops are complete. Don't you feel warmer just by looking at these flip-flops? Totally gives off summer vibes. Okay, but we can get a little warmer. Now let's make our Play-Doh bag. We'll roll out some light yellow Play-Doh again. 
Let's use the cutter we used earlier, but this time we'll make the full shape. Afterwards, cut off the top. Okay, now let's roll out some yellow Play-Doh. Let's use this cutter again. We don't need a full shape this time because we only need half for this color. There we go. Now let's make our bag. This yellow piece is important because it won't make our bag look so flimsy. Place the light yellow pieces on each side. Perfect. We have our bag. Now it's time to add some details. Going to use a little bit of pink, blue, and purple Play-Doh. Start by rolling out the purple Play-Doh. Now we're going to use this cutter to make a cool design. It's like a crescent shape. Now let's do the same with the blue Play-Doh. And the pink Play-Doh. Perfect. Now let's attach these three pieces onto our bag. Awesome! Now let's cut away some of this extra Play-Doh. That looks beautiful. Now let's make the bag straps. We're going to make the same design as the flip-flop straps. Poke two holes on each side. Perfect. Alright, got that ready. Now let's make our bag straps. Twist these two strands. Cut it in half. Okay, now let's attach one strap on this side first. Perfect. Now finish up the other side. Excellent. Alright, here's a closer look at our bag. Oh yeah, these two items together, I can definitely feel summer. Don't you feel warmer already? I definitely do. Awesome, Pop fans! Thank you so much for watching. We can't do this without you. If you're new to the channel and became a fan, click that subscribe button for more awesome stuff. And if you want to be the first person to watch our next video, hit that notification bell to have a chance. See ya!